I don't look full Samoan. That's because my dad is Balangi. The Samoan side comes from my mother's side. My parents met in Kingsland. My dad was throwing a party with his flatmates. He had a girl on his knee, my mum walked in, he stood up, that girl dropped on the floor and he only had eyes for my mother. Love at first sight, really. I just wonder if you could help me. Oh my god. I'm looking for an opinion. You're more likely to get me in bed than her with your ridiculous cupcakes. Hey, how are you going? You trying to crowbar your way into Dawes' life is not destiny. That is stalking. I just want her to remember how much she loved me. I went to acting school in the late 90s. It was funny, I, I, I didn't intend on being an actor, I kind of just fell into it. The thing is... I don't know about you, but... I don't think I could settle for just the coffee. And now, I can't think of doing anything else. A man needs a woman to make his meals, to sweep his floor, to mend his clothes, to light his lamp when night comes. Blow it out when it's time for bed. Not this man. Well, it goes back to my great grandmother, who was the first actor in our family. She starred alongside Gary Cooper in Return to Paradise. Henrietta Godney was her name. She was actually a big inspiration for me. You know, she was alongside one of these Hollywood greats and thinking, wow, wow, my great grandmother did that. I'd really like to do that one day. Here's a tip replace the bulbs you use the most first to get the biggest benefit. If we all changed to energy efficient bulbs, the power savings would be like New Zealand switching off 15 million light bulbs forever. And I, these days I get a lot of people saying hi to me and, and asking for tips about ways to save energy. Hey, Mr. Heartbreaker. The family name of the Samoan side is Cruze, uh, obviously German Samoans who came there prior to World War I and my grandparents came over in the early 50s, had seven children. This here is my pop's ukulele. I remember um, back in the day when there was lots of family reunions, he'd be strumming away, sitting on his belly, playing some songs back from, from the islands. Very special to me, um, so I've since started teaching myself how to play the ukulele and hopefully one day I'll be resting it on my belly playing those songs. And this uh, Nifuati here is it's a keepsake to remind me of my, my late grandmother. When I'm watching other Samoans um, be successful in their, in their field, um, whether it be sports or the arts, I do have a, a sense of pride. You know, when you go to Samoa and, and, and everybody's so proud of somebody like The Rock, you know, it's always cool to see a Samoan up there doing something awesome. My perfect world. Well, in my world, the waves would always be good. My kids would have everything they wanted, everything they needed as well. I would own a vineyard, enjoy the sunsets with a nice plate of fruit. <laughs> um, and in my world, travel would be free.